Will Mott's warehouse is proof that you can take literally any activity or concept at all and turn it into a very fun video game. Case in point, Will Mott's warehouse is about running a warehouse full of stuff and trying to keep that stuff organized. And this is Wilmot, probably the second most charming square in video game history. And down there we have a delivery coming into our warehouse and it's going to have a bunch of different squares. This game's kind of tile based but also not tile based, it's kind of weird. Oh boy. Uh, so we have a bunch of objects over here that we already have and our goal is to simply just like sort these objects by whatever categories that we choose ourselves. And some of these objects I have never seen before. Okay then. Um, some of these are more clear than others. We have a map of some sorts right there. We have fangs. We have lips. We have... I don't... What? We're going to say that's uvula. We have soup. Uh, cheese. We have a tent. Some barbecue. And some spotlights. The bat signal apparently. Um, Alright. Well let's just start picking these up. You can pick up a group of things. Um, right now our maximum is like six. So right now we're just gonna take these up. I have no idea how I'm gonna be sorting these. Well, the game already kind of gave us a hint, sort of. We have like fishing hooks over here, ice cream things here, uh, teeth things, and the barbecue. I don't, I'm gonna put this down here because this is kind of in its own category. All right, let's grab this fang. And these lips, what can I do with these lips? Uh, cause we already have this fang category up here, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the lips next to the fangs, cause that just makes sense. I messed up everything. <laughs> next up we got cheese! I mean, cheese is food, and last time I checked, popsicles are also food, so that's gonna be what we're gonna have to do. I don't like that association, but here, you know what we'll do actually? We'll just put, um, yeah, do this. We'll put it in the same, like, vicinity, but not right next to it, because they're not entirely the same. Also, I only have a minute left to sort the rest of these. I'm going to start hurrying up. Tents. Um, tents can be a sur uh, survival, or... Actually, you know what? Sort of can the barbecue. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll sort the tents with barbecue things. I'm going to say these are uvulas for now, and put them there. I know that's not good placement, where I just what I just did, but um, whatever. Also, that's a, another two, so we'll put that there. Fish hook, that can go over here by the fish hooks. And I do not know what to do with the searchlight. I'll put that by the fire, the barbecue thing, I guess. 10 seconds left. Okay, well, all we have is one thing of soup. <laughs> Very good. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll put that there. Why not? And that's the liver phase done. So now we need to deliver our objects to these people. So we need one thing of fangs and one thing of ice cream. So we'll go grab that and bring it up here. And you need a map and cheese. Map was way down here, and she's was by the ice cream, which is over here. There we go. Bring that up, and there we go. Oh, and then go and do that so we can clock in early and earn some stars, which we can use to upgrade stuff. All right, new delivery. What do we got? More. Oh, this is a lot of things. Okay, so we got some new things now. So we have some shorts. We got some more lips. Okay, we got some, like, chattering teeth. I'll just grab all that for now. The fangs can obviously go here. The chattering teeth, I literally don't know. <laughs> I mean, obviously they're gonna go near here, but they're kind of edging towards the camping stuff. You know, vaguely camping. <laughs> and now we have shorts. I have no clue where to put these. I guess you could associate those with hiking. We're gonna put those by... <laughs> People wear shorts while hiking, right? I, not that I would know. All right, I mean, left to search all the stuff. So we have lights now, <laughs> like light bulbs, I don't know. Oh wait, no, we have these with search lights. That's perfect. I'm carrying too much stuff. Hold on. All right, we're gonna just put all of this in bulk right here. Uh, no one forget that. Um, please remind me when I forget, inevitably. Grab the barbecues, and we also have glue, I think? I'm gonna assume that's glue and not something that's inappropriate. All right, what do we need? We need two barbecue, two maps. Those are the two important ones. If we complete those, we'll get some stars. So we need those, and the maps are down here. We're running out of maps, apparently. Grab those, okay. And then we need the things and these searchlights, which I remember are over here, I think. Okay, good. <laughs> My memory has not failed me yet. So after every phase of uh, bringing the stuff to the, to the peoples, <laughs> Very descriptive, I know. Uh, the game adds a bunch of new items for you. You can see a wall of them right here, so you can get an idea of how you can organize stuff. No time to rest now, though. We got another delivery phase. There are always three minutes, and there's always a big-ass truck. And come on out. So what do we have here? We have more things, more... Sh what? I'm gonna be honest. I don't know what that, <laughs> what that is. We also now have tongues sticking out. I guess I can put those by all the other mouth-related things. <laughs> I gotta be honest, this is not what I was expecting to be be referring to when I started playing this game today, but here we are. 
Oh, look at that. Perfect insertion. I don't know why I would call that. It, it, definitely not perfect. <laughs> oh, what's that? Do we got some soup? I think we got some soup. There we go. This where does this go? Uh, there we go. <laughs> As you might have noticed, there's a bit of a fog of war. Yes, I did just say that unironically. There's a fog of war in this game, so you can't just see where everything is. Um, what do we have here? We're gonna put that. Uh, I just realized there's a number of things that could I could have said for this besides glue. This could be sun, like sunscreen. That could be mayonnaise. That would honestly work pretty well. It could go in the food category. Uh, I mean, if we're being honest here, I think pretty much all of these could go in the food category, but whatever. I seriously have no clue what those even are trying to be. So we're gonna put these by the map and assume that's okay. Trust me, I know that this is very disorganized right now, but in a minute, we're gonna be able to organize a little bit better. Okay, drop that right there. What do you need? You need three lips, three barbecue. Okay, let's see. Three lips are down here. And barbecue, I can actually see the outline of. Get out of the way. I regret putting those there. All right, come on, come on, come on. There we go. And then you need the mayonnaise and the teeth. Uh, I don't remember where those are. <laughs> One, two, and then grab the teeth. One, two, three. Boom. There we go. All right, now is the beginning of a stock take, which means a couple of things. One, we can buy upgrades, including rotate blocks. I want that very much. We're going to grab that. Uh, also, yeah, sure, we'll get a carry increase. Um, that's all I really need for now. But the main thing about stock tech is that you have as much time as you need to go back and just organize the heck out of everything. Because inevitably, your things are gonna get out of control very quickly. So let's see if we can make this a little bit better. Make this a little more organized. Also, if I'm not wrong, I think we get another big delivery of a lot of lights. <laughs> yeah, sure, okay. Well, first things first, we really need to fix up this, um... Th whatever this is i don't even know actually hold on you know what we can do we'll put these like that so it's not taking up as much space because trust me you will be using all of this space <laughs> there's enough of these uvulas i think we can go ahead and just put those down there but not enough of the uh fangs that they can go down there if, it, if that makes any sense at all um hmm do you think this is going to be where we're going to be putting the lights <laughs> Ironically, I've made a hook where the hooks are. I actually kind of like that. I'm gonna leave it there. In fact, I'm going to extend it. There we go. We still have this random pair of bunny ears. I literally have no clue where I'm gonna put those. Um, by the barbecue. <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, you know what? Those are shoes. Now that I look at that, they're like cleats. I hope you're not hiking with cleats on, but whatever. Um, oh gosh, this food section is completely out of control. Oh my goodness. Here, let's just. Let's just do that that will that'll be fine um and then we just have a bunch of cheese oh, let's go ahead and move these over here because it's kind of annoying having them on completely different sides also i kind of don't like having these hmm you know what i'm probably going to move this over to the hiking section we're just gonna put it all in one big outdoors put the tents there and the bunny ears i uh <laughs> I mean, I still like the idea of being them on, putting them on barbecue, but I also don't want to completely block out where the barbecue is. Okay, we'll just put it there, just as a reminder. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to have to deal with these at some point. Um, Let's just grab a whole chunk of them. This is going to actually take up so much space that I'm probably going to put these back here. Oh my gosh, this is, there are so many spotlights. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this? Oh gosh. What if we just have the light bulbs and the spotlights facing each other in some sort of big light standoff? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then we have to go. I'm just gonna put all of that right there. <laughs> just put that there. There we go. Hmm. That'll do for now. Is everything good over here? We still have. Yeah, this is probably the best I'm gonna get for the moment. What do you need? We need, oh my gosh, okay. Three hooks. The hook hook is going away. Um, what else you need? You need a lot of uvulas. I can't believe that's just what I'm referring to them now, and a lot of spotlights. Take those. All right, you need ice creams. We're gonna, <laughs> don't ask me why I took it out like that. But uh, last thing we need is the tent. Oh, they took all of our tents. Alrighty then, there we go. I could wait to check in. It would give me more time to like organize, but uh, who needs the extra time? That's not what I wanted to see. Explosions, huh? In the sun and half an egg. Okay, what am I putting these? Because they kind of look like eggs, but 
I could also see them as being like angry eyes or something, like half of an eyeball. As graphic as that sounds. Um, would it be messed up if I put them with the food category? Not messed up enough for me to not do it. Alright, now we have the sun and also explosives. <laughs> or an e explosion. Um, I could put those with the barbecue if I really wanted to, but I think I'm just going to give them with their own category down here. Um, also rabbits are here for some reason. Oh good, we got more light bulbs. This is <laughs> We're about to run out, thank goodness. Alright, <laughs> they keep taking our tents away. Those damn millennials with their tenting. <laughs> Need fish hooks, uvulas. Sounds like a really bad Friday night. Alright, next up we have a police light, a campfire, hmm, a candle, okay then, and a trumpet. Where the fuck did the trumpet come from? <laughs> oh look guys, I got a brand new motivational poster for my hard work. Remember, always lift with your legs, not with your back. Strong advice, unless you're a square, unless you don't have legs or a back. Alright, I'm putting the watermelons by the fish hooks, but don't question it. Oh shoot, where did I put the white cream again? I genuinely do not remember. Did I put it up here? We don't have white cream, do we? <laughs> Well, it's officially mayonnaise now. All right, guys, we got more tents, but don't get, don't don't get used to having them because they'll be gone in like two minutes. About okay, now I have to deal with the trumpets. I'm sure in some world those are used for camping equipment, <laughs> so that's where we're gonna put them. Oh no, we're out of time. I don't have time to sort any of this. Uh oh boy. Hey, do you want these? You want one of them? <laughs> So we'll take that. Okay, um, um, we need three of these. Oh, and three of these. That actually works out really, really nicely. Wow, the hooks have just been dissolved. We have no more hooks anymore. Oh, right, I forgot. You can demolish the pillars, which doesn't seem like a good idea to me personally. But if management wants it, that's what will happen. All right, the explosion can go there. Uh, what do we got? <laughs> what do we got this time? Uh, oh, besides the three things I forgot. Well, ooh, we have three different things. That's not nearly as overwhelming. I didn't realize, where the heck am I going to put this police light? I guess just by all the rest of the lights, although that doesn't really make that much sense. And finally, the fish hook can go over here. I've, I've officially just... I associate watermelons with fish hooks now. That's just the way... That's what this game does to you. Hey, remember when I said this was going to be a... This was a lot less overwhelming? It's kind of a lot more overwhelming. Because I'm starting to realize, where the heck am I going to put 10 lips in my my system where there's only one of them? <laughs> you know what? I can do this. There we go. That leaves enough room so that if I need to carry a, a, like, a mass amount of lights from over there, then it shouldn't be too big of a deal. Although, this isn't great. Alright, maps. Where are you right now? I don't like that. I mean, I could just put these here if I really want to, but I don't think that's going to work. Okay, what if I make room where the shorts are? We put these over here. That makes them a little long, but I can live with that. And then we just do that. Perfect. Push those right there. Move you right there. Honestly, that worked better than I thought it was going to. So we're going to keep it. And then we have like eight shark teeth, which is practically nothing. Why did it have to be teeth? Why did it have to be mouth things? <laughs> I feel like at some point I'm going to accidentally predict the name of Neil Cicerega's next mouth album. What do we need? We need lots of... Oh, well, guess what? I got the shark teeth for you. Yep. Um, what else do you need? You need barbecues and suns. We have the entire sun packed in one warehouse. Get some lips and the... um. <laughs> some candles we are literally just making the flaming lips now all right what do we got next we have toothpaste on a toothbrush a hashtag a piece of cake and another tooth <laughs> why why did you have to do that all right come on in truck driver i just realized the truck driver is not a geometrical shape Huh, I wonder what the lore- <laughs> What is the Wilmot's Warehouse lore? Well, you know what? I'll give you this. Toothpaste does work well with the mouth category, so I guess it's all fine. I'm running out of room in the mouth category. I didn't even know there were this many mouth things in the game. <laughs> I don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> Barbecue, I just realized that we have to do put a hashtag somewhere, and we literally have nowhere for that to go. <laughs> There is not a single category I have where that makes any remote amount of sense. 
literally, I am going to just leave the hashtag there. It's not my problem until it is my problem. Um, you need compass, you need mayonnaise. I thought I only had one of those. Wait, hold on. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Wait, where did I put... Guys, we have an issue. I have lost the mayonnaise. <laughs> Maybe it's still in the delivery. Hold on. Yes, there it is. Okay, cool. <laughs> we have an umbrella slash parasol. Another sun on a cloudy day. Partially cloudy, we'll call it. A firework from Acme, apparently. And an animal, probably a bear nose. <laughs> Would it be wrong for me to put that in the food category? <laughs> You know, instead of adding it to the food category, maybe we'll add it- maybe we'll create a new animal category. That seems to make more sense than just putting everything that is vaguely alive in the food category. Okay, where am I gonna push this hashtag? You know what, I'm probably just gonna put it here. Because they literally has nowhere else to go. Guys, I don't mean to alarm you, but we have too many maps. Oh, see? Yeah, see, that's exactly why I never want to have more than like th I will always want to have a gap of three. That's pretty much always the size of my, uh, whatever I'm carrying. So it works out if it's like that. Um, what hasn't worked out is that we're out of time. Our daily dose of lip. <laughs> Here we go. We have literally all of them, the rest of the objects are in this pile of mouth things. Okay, the maps are seriously becoming an issue. I need to do something about this. The question is, what do I do about this? What if I move the barbecue things? Would that help at all? If I just put them like down here by the campfire? Honestly, not a bad idea. I like it. Oh good, great. That's exactly what I wanted. All of the hashtags. Oh boy, do we want to deal with the fish hooks or the hashtags first? <laughs> that is indeed the question for this game. I guess I'll figure out what to do with the hashtags. I mean, I can't exactly just put all of them up here, can I? Wait, can I? Yes, yeah, sure, don't even bother organizing them. If they want the hashtags, they can just reach over the window to grab it themselves. <laughs> Guys, I think it's time for the grand return <laughs> of the hook of hooks. <laughs> there we go. Technically, that is a hook. And I'm not gonna tolerate anyone who says otherwise. And of course, we're gonna put the melons here because at this point, it's a meme. What do we need? Light bulbs, okay. Do you, are you sure you don't want any hashtags? Because I would... <laughs> be more than happy to oblige and then while we're over here we're gonna grab nothing because nothing i need is over here very good oh no shoot i can't <laughs> okay so maybe they get in the way a little bit but it's fine oh my god no please i can't get over there no come on take the things thank you okay hold on no i have an idea what if we just split them off evenly like this i think that works they're covering up the thing but Okay, that's fine. There we go. Easy peasy. There right, we got. What is that? What? Tell me what that is. Game, I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna let this one slide. What am I looking at right now? <laughs> well, that's a bubble wand. That's a. Oh, good. More lights. Good. I know what this is, but I don't know where to put it. <laughs> we'll put it by the umbrella because. What? <laughs> That's the only logic I have for that. Oh, we got our horns back. Thank goodness. I was almost afraid that we wouldn't be able to toot our horns while, once we reach the top of the mountain. There we go. And clock in. Whew. I think that makes a full year of our work here at Wilmot's Warehouse. This has been Wilmot's Warehouse. And yeah, this is one of my most favorite puzzle games ever, to be honest. It's just really fun. It's both it's the perfect balance of being very stressful but also being very relaxing and just really satisfying because you you do everything by yourself it's, just, it's up to you to decide how you interpret these objects like i don't know maybe this could have this could didn't have to be toothpaste this could have been okay there's pretty much nothing else that could have been but still also this game is like way more replayable than i thought it was like half of these objects that have shown up i didn't even know existed in this game and I've already beaten it. <laughs> so yeah, this is this game does have a lot of value. Uh, and a lot of playtime as well. This game is available on Steam and also Xbox Game Pass. So if you're interested in this game and you have Game Pass, then go ahead and give this game a shot. It's really good. So yeah, thank you for watching. Remember to keep your teeth collection organized. And goodbye. Goodbye.